Hey guys, we got a Rowdy out today. Rowdy is about a four-year-old um, uh, Border Collie mix, and uh, man, he's he's a lot of fun. He's a great dog. Um, he's got a few bad habits that we're going to be working on this week. One of those is chasing cows, if you can imagine that. Um, and so with his breed, it's not unusual for them to want to chase cows and to herd things. Uh, in fact, I've got a video of him herding our uh, little robot vacuum this morning. Uh, so it's definitely instinctual for him. Uh, but what we're working on and most concerned with is his recall. So to want to chase a cow is fine, but to come back when called is another thing entirely. So we're going to be working on that, among other things, uh, during his two weeks with us. But today we're starting out with foundations, and our foundation is going to be uh, uh, the heel lesson. What we're working on today is leash pressure. So we've got a slip lead on his neck today. And we've also got the e-collar. We're starting our e-collar conditioning today, which will help with the uh, recall. So uh, what we're doing is when he feels pressure on the leash, that's a correction. And then at the same time he feels that correction, we're going to give him a slight stimulation with the e-collar. And I say slight and I mean slight because I just want him to uh, become adjusted to that sensation uh, so that we can transition to a point where he's um, where he uh, is on the e-collar exclusively and we're not worried about uh, him being off leash. So those are some things that we're doing. So follow us for just a second and I'll kind of coach you through it and see how he's doing on heel. So we're starting out in a sit then we're going to lead out and simply say, Rowdy, heel. Good. I've got him on my left, which is typical. So as he's going out there and you see that, that leash tighten, um, I'm giving him a slight correction with both the leash and the e-collar. Good, yes. It comes back into position. I'm going to praise that. We're going to mark that with yes or good. Uh-uh, heel. Good, yes. Now, let's say that he starts to lead me a little bit. Right here, I'm going to say heel. And we're going to start walking in circles. My goal here is that I'm just getting ahead of him, teaching him to get out of my way, and that he doesn't know where we're going. There we go. Good, yes. See, immediately he drops back. Now, that's not going to stick because this is our first walk, but uh, we'll repeat that pattern over and over throughout the next uh, couple weeks until we get it right consistently. Good boy, Rowdy. Good boy. Good heel. And then whenever we're at a stopping point, we'll just say, Rowdy, sit. Rowdy, sit. Yes, good boy. So I gave him slight pressure with the, the leash and the e-collar. He went into a sit. That's excellent, excellent work. Uh, excited to see how this dog continues to grow.